Uh, third quarter GDP figures out of Indonesia show that the economy is growing at its slowest pace in over two years. Gross domestic product rising 5.02% for the July to September period. That's compared to a year ago. And it's also down from the 5.05% growth that was seen in Q2. Now, Indonesia's slowing economic growth is widely expected as prices for key commodities such as coal and palm oil continue to fall. Although Southeast Asia's largest economy relies more on domestic demand, the China-U.S. trade war has affected its exports, which in turn dented domestic consumer sentiment and consumption. Bank Indonesia, that's the country's central bank, has already slashed interest rates four times. That's since July. And it is expected to continue easing rates in the coming months. Now, the downward trend for Indonesia's economic growth places President Joko Widodo on the spot. That's after he won re-election in April on promises of more investment. At his inauguration just last month, Mr. Widodo unveiled his vision to make Indonesia one of the top five economies of the world by the year 2045.